happens after the embryo transfer and what are the signs of a successful implantation? Very good question. If the transfer is performed on day 5 of the embryo development, the embryo, which is usually ready to nest around day 6 or 7, should be implanting, nesting, in the next two days or so following the transfer. Uh, honestly, there are hardly any signs of the implantation itself. The embryo at that point has about two tenths of a millimeter in diameter and uh, its attachment to the endometrium and the, the beginning of the process of the implantation uh, you cannot feel at all. There might be actually one sign that's kind of typical for these initial two weeks. There might be a slight spotting or even even a weak bleeding sometimes. As the embryo nests, it uh, breaks some of the capillaries and starts to communicate with the mother's organism. Sometimes this pool of blood, this little pool of blood, uh, can uh, actually escape from the uterine cavity and can present, present itself as a spotting or a bleeding. If that happens, no panic, keep taking your medications and bed rest is recommended for the duration of the spotting. As soon as it's over, then you can get more active again. Otherwise, the other uh, signs or, uh, of, of an early pregnancy, such as nausea or uh, headaches or uh, pressure in the breasts, they usually come later in the process, not during those first two weeks before we uh, perform the pregnancy test. So during these initial 14 days, we really need to be patient and we need to to wait for the test result with egg donation.